One minute. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. And we're back. Just like that. I switched up the transition. There's no longer that like, woo, you go in and out kind of thing. It's like a slide now. What's going on? Am I too loud? Am I, I feel like I'm too loud. What's going on? Welcome 
Jeez, I'm way too loud. What the heck? What's going on, everyone? Welcome to another stream. Let me cut that music out and start this one. Hope you guys are enjoying the hype, the build-up to Tower of God. Okay, I understand that I'm excited every week because it's Tower of God. Like, I get that. But at the same time, you guys have been freaking hyping this chapter, bro. Like, even more than usual. Like, usually you guys are like, oh, this is a good chapter. I've seen nothing but comments saying, Joe, you're, you're not going to believe this chapter. Joe, this chapter is really... I cannot wait to see Joe's reaction. Like, look at Star Razor in the chat. You're not ready for this chapter, Joe. Trust me. Like, what could possibly... Like, what could possibly happen? Like, uh, freaking someone rising from the dead? I'm just I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm just like, what, what the, I don't know what to expect, bro. And then Cassie comes in saying, not gonna lie, I don't remember this chapter. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right, who we got? We got Nivik, Krazo, Bruna, Star Razor, Light, Evan Kel. Evan Kel, welcome, welcome. Sasuke, Snow, Barbie, Pyro, Loria, Angelo, Dude, Kareem, local INTP. Happy to have everybody in the chat. So, last time, if you don't remember, Yama had a bit of a close call uh, with Yasracha, but luckily was saved by the boy, Hockney and his team. They were able to basically secure a, a and purchase an item, or essentially purchase something that was able to temporarily save Yama, which we all knew was gonna happen, but I really like this because you can tell Yasracha almost preferred this, because once again, his goal isn't to kill Yama. He could have killed Yama at any point. His goal is to break Yama, and he thinks that this gap in time will just allow Yama to break and break even more. So I almost feel like Yasracha, he's totally fine with this, like, turn of events. A uh, Keyblade guy, thank you very much for the super chat saying, another reaction, I can't wait for your, or another chapter, I can't wait for your reaction, maybe on the level of the white reveal. Huh? No way. You're get, you're get, you're getting me too excited, stop it. You're getting, like, I know, I know it doesn't seem like it, it seems like my usual excitement, but I, I was just driving today, I went to visit my family, and I was driving back, and I was like, I couldn't get my mind off this chapter, I was like, we're actually getting more content, and I don't know, I don't know. Is it too much? Maybe it's too much. This chapter begins in earnest? Okay, okay. Cassie says, I'm your favorite mod, who decided that? Who decided that? <laughs> I'm just uh, okay, we got the fake spoilers coming in. Try- I mean, I get it's a joke, but, uh, try to keep it to a minimum. That's- that's totally cool, but... You kind of scared me for a second, I was like, wait a minute. Um, but- but yeah, so if you guys are new to the channel, welcome. I'm assuming most of you are here, uh, for the content already. Um, we make a lot of Tower of God videos here. Some of it's, you know, simple stuff. Like yesterday, I made a video kind of just- just for fun, talking about alternative Tower of God protagonists. Um, I just kind of put it together really quick. Other times we break out into Tower of God lore, so stick around for those kinds of videos if it's something you like. Subscribe for more of it, and stuff like that. If you're new. If you're not new, then I'm just, uh, I'm talking to the, what's the, what's the term? Talking to the choir, whatever, preaching to the choir. Anyway, I want to look at this chapter. I want to actually break it down for a sec here. Uh, let me pull it up. Chrome. My green screen is looking pretty good today. It's weird that my my green screen is like a it's like a human being, bro. It's like a person. It has its own personality. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad, sometimes it's pretty on point, sometimes it's totally whack. Um, you never know with uh, with my green screen, you know. And it pretty much always has this like little corner down here, but there's not usually much I can do about that. Actually, that's a little better. And then I always nitpick and make it worse. That always happens. So, what's interesting here is that Kuhn had this plan. He told the plan to Hockney, and then he freaking dips. He's like, oh, a mouse, I get to go help Bomb. And then he just leaves. He just leaves, just like that. And this makes me nervous because if Kuhn really does catch this mouse, although it's probably a trap, right? If, but if he does catch this mouse and goes and teams up with Bomb, is Bomb gonna be happy to see him? Because I'm not gonna lie, I think Bomb's gonna have a problem with the way that Kuhn has been handling this situation regarding deaths, regarding information for Bomb, regarding a lot of things. 
So it makes me a little nervous um, how Bomb will react to, to seeing Kuhn. Um, we get our, our absolute Princess Elaine. Good gravy. Um, and they basically outsmart the crab, Druggy, by using some teamwork, and they save Yama. Okay, now this was the best part of the chapter. Getting to actually see some of the the Papa Baylord backstory, the Daddy Baylord, right? We're getting to see part of it. And I really like this. It's not all of it. We're not actually seeing it. Like, we're not getting a full flashback, but we're getting told what happened. This is fantastic. I love the relationship between Doom and Yama. What I'm wondering is if when Yama's getting pierced here, like, obviously he's going to be fine, but what about Doom? Like, is Doom fine without the Fang? I don't know. Tower of God lore on Shinwei? Yes, it's on my list. Keyblade Guy says, thank you for the super chat. Who do you think will collect all the 13 months? Bomb? Is that who the weapons are waiting for? I think Bomb's a likely candidate. I kind of wish it wasn't, though, because I feel like Bomb kind of gets everything. But I wouldn't mind it. I think it's cool if Bomb collected the weapons, especially since they seem to like him. But I feel like, you know, Bomb's getting the weapons. He's getting maybe the Essence of Bravery and this and that, you know? No, no confirmation on the Essence of Bravery, but... It makes me kind of wish we, we got a little bit, like the characters shared the powers a little bit, but we'll see. We'll definitely see. Uh, Dark Innervator. Inner, I said the Innervator. Dark Innervator. Thank you very much for the super chat. I'm looking forward to your reaction this chapter, Joe. I shall not spoil it except for four words. The trap is afoot. Shoot. Well, that's no surprise. It's Tower of God. There's constantly traps and betrayals. Thank you very much for the super chat, Dark Innervator. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Um, yeah, so, I don't know, man. This, it's getting hype. It's getting hype. Ooh, I'm getting butterflies. We had three minutes. Okay, also, we had this amazing scene between Bomb and Arya, where Bomb, you know, he's being Bomb. He's like, I don't care if it's a trap, blah, blah, blah. Fantastic quotes about he, he doesn't want loneliness, but she loves loneliness, and like, blah, 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 blah. And then he says this. This is the bombshell. I'll sell my soul if I have to. Bomb is okay. This is canon. It's canon that Bomb is seemingly okay with being corrupt if it means saving his friends. Which is insane. But then Arya says, is that really what the dead want? Which is, of course, what we're all thinking, right? Like, would Prince and Ark Raptor be like, Hey, Bomb, thanks for going berserk to avenge us. It's like, no, come on. They... They chased Bomb knowing the danger. They teamed up with Bomb knowing he was a Slayer candidate, knowing all the dangers associated with it, and yet time and time again, they worked with him, and they were okay with being in involved with him because they, they understood that they are family. But they also care about Bomb. They wouldn't want Bomb to risk his own life or risk his own state of self for, for something like that, which is really beautiful, man. It's beautiful, bro. It's really, really good. This was a really good chapter. I really liked it. This was like, ah, so good. Jeremy Joestar with the $2 super chat. We need a Kalavan and love focus chapter. Dude, I, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get the love. We've gotta get the love. You know what I'm saying? Like we've got, if we're getting Namo and so, Namo and Sola, we gotta get love. We gotta get Mule love. I think Mule love is gonna fight Nanatona. I, I think uh, Haku of the Tubes, Tower of God YouTuber, made that theory a while ago that maybe Love would think that Nanatona is one of the mice that they have to kill, right? Because Nanatona looks like a mouse. And so that's how they're gonna fight. I really think that'd be, I think that'd be funny. Um, and they're, they're both short, they're both, you know, Nanatona is not a high ranker and neither is Love. So I think they'd be a good matchup, but who knows? Maybe something else. We also have Hasacha. Hasacha hasn't been fought yet. If you don't know who Hasacha is, Hasacha is the female feline. I don't know how else to describe her. She rides in that floating, like, white bubble-looking thing. And yes, Racha's army. We haven't fought her yet. Um, so there's still a couple of people left that we haven't actually had combat with yet. So maybe Love or some of the other characters we haven't seen yet fight them. I think Love is one of the only, or like, yeah, I think Love is pretty much the only person we haven't seen yet. We've seen Doan and Karaka and Cha. We haven't seen Love. That's actually interesting. We got some Hasacha simping going on. All right, it's 8.59. 8.59. Since we have a minute, um, I want to um, just let you know. I'm sure you've heard me say this before, so I apologize if you've heard it already. But this Friday, we're starting a new series, Tower of God-themed 
Pokemon Randomizer Nuzlocke. Basically, all Pokemon are random. We're giving them Tower of God names. We're gonna see which ones live, which ones die. This Friday at 4 p.m. Eastern Time, it's gonna be so much fun. Like, randomizer Nuzlocke and just Nuzlocke in general are so much freaking fun. So if you wanna tune in for that and be there from the very beginning, that'd be super, super fun. It's gonna be a blast. So this Friday, definitely stay tuned for that. Um, all right, it's nine o'clock. We hit the refresh button until it works. Come on, SIU. Come on, Webtoon. Give it to me. Come on. What if we crash the website? Wouldn't that be funny? Please don't. <laughs> Please don't. Because <laughs> if we do... No, I'm just kidding. We, we don't have enough people to crash the website, right? Wait, I'm not logged in. Oh, I am logged in. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, come on now. I got to like the chapters. Usually 9.01, yeah, it usually takes a minute, which is totally fair. I mean, a lot of people are waiting to read, you know, the newest chapter. Well, it's 9.01! Ah, there it is! Okay, there it is, there it is, there it is. Okay, we get Arya on the thumbnail. Interesting, here we go, baby! Tower of God, episode 85, season 3, chapter 502. I can't believe we're past chapter 500. Let's freaking do it, let's freaking do it. We're not wasting any time. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, here we go. He said he wants me to be corrupt. Like himself. Okay, we already saw this, but I'm going to read it anyway so we can get a refresher leading into the future content. So he wants you to be a bad guy like... Blah, he wants you to be a bad guy like him, huh? For a legendary slayer, he sure thinks like an immature teenager. Just so true. So you're waiting for him now because you want to give him what he wants? Yeah. If I can just avenge those who died and beat White, I don't care if I have to be corrupt. I'll sell my soul if I have to. Is that really what the dead want? There we go. All right, we got the refresher. Tower of God, a dark change, chapter four. Once we scroll, it's new content. It's new content as soon as I scroll. I could stay here. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. Huh. This is Arya? Arya? Hey, by the way. Oh, here we go. All right. Here we go! Alright, what's what's Bum's response gonna be? I feel like she should have asked this a long time. Arya is so kind, bro. She hasn't been like, hey, break my spell. She's like, it's gonna get better, you know? Like we gotta we gotta run away. And then she's like, so you're gonna break the spell on me, right? Uh shoot, okay. <laughs> she's like, hey, hey, I understand. <laughs> Freaking Arya, bro. I understand your situation, but a promise is a promise, and I did help you get this far, right? You're not going to break your promise, are you? Uh, not that I'm rushing you because I'm worried you might die in battle with White. I'll do it for you. Okay. Good. But also, hmm. Hmm. You might need her. But the, okay, but this is Bomb's fight. Okay, this is... That was the right move. That was the right move. What? I'll break that spell. I made a promise. I mean, without her, you wouldn't have gotten out of that situation, so... Good good on Baum for keeping his promises. Oh, okay. That was easier than I thought. I was worried he might ask me to help him more and add more conditions to our deal. But I... I thought that might happen, but then again, it would go against Baum's character. Like, Baum isn't like, I need her help, so I'm gonna break our promise. You know, so it definitely makes sense. But just don't attack me. I'm going to fight White. And as you said, he may very well kill me. Oh, this is interesting. We're getting more on this. Okay, I promise. Yeah, she, I don't think she would hurt you. Can he, he can do it from that far? Is it that easy? He did it. Bomb, dude, Bomb is broken. Can we talk about this? Bomb is disgustingly broken. The fact that he could just go, all right, boop, you're done. Like the workshop made this spell and it took him one second. That's insane. That horrible suffocating feeling is gone. <laughs> I'm free, she's so happy. Okay, so here's the question. She's free, apparently, which is kind of insane. I thought, I thought there was gonna be something bad that happened with her, but this makes me think, what's she gonna do? Now that she's free, she can do whatever she wants. What's she gonna do? What's her choice? He really is powerful. 
how did he break this spell so easily? Bro, look how happy she is. It's it's our goal in life to be as happy as Arya is at this moment. That spell has been tormenting me for my whole life. And he just made it go away with one wave of his hand. He, whoop, he made it seem so simple that it's almost depressing. <laughs> She's like, bro, this is not fair. Who on earth is this guy? Is the spell broken now? Uh, yeah, I think so. Then don't attack me like you promised. I'm going to fight White. Does this boy realize how incredible that was just now? Could you, dude, I, I don't know because Ar Arya has no real reason to help Bomb, but it would be so tragic and so like heroic if she decided to and ended up like maybe dying because she has that freedom now. None of the tower's laws can touch him. He's in a league of his own. I feel so powerless around him. I can kind of understand how White feels. Maybe he's doomed to be resented. And yet, for some reason, five minutes, that's how much time I've got. I feel like I shouldn't resent him because he's the best boy. He's the 25th bomb, Arya, embrace it. I know you want to simp for him. Just embrace it, it's okay. A lot of us have fallen for it. Just embrace it, it's fine. He doesn't deserve to be hated. Bro, he shouldn't be corrupted. Save him! Save him! Take him by the scruff of his neck and just get out of there! Objectively speaking, whether that boy dies in battle with White or not doesn't concern me at all. You're such a liar. But I should at least repay him for finally breaking that spell for me. Yes! Let's go! The duo! The tower's ultimate duo is still- Guys, we're still- It's fine. It's fine. Bomb and Arya. The duo has not been split. Let's go. Hey, do I have the option of opening this prison too? Oh. Interesting. Wait, what's she? Yes, you do. This is McBurn, but your goal isn't to reach the finish line, so you don't absolutely have to open it. Are you sure you wish to open the prison? Open it! Wait, what's her plan? Wait. Is she pl- Wait a minute! Whoa, 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 whoa! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! Hold on a second! Is her goal to advance Bomb by force? Like, if she takes out this next target and says, we advance. But then again, I'm not sure if she can dictate whether Bomb advances or not. The prison is now opening. Why? Why are you opening that? Shut up. I just felt like- Shut up. I just felt like it. I can't help you fight White, but I can at least get rid of the monster for you. Okay. Fair enough. Okay. Okay. There's no way even the map boss is stronger than White. Oh, is- Oh, this is the big boy! What? Or one of the big boys? I don't know. But we're enemies. Why would you- Whether you die or not, I don't want to lose- I don't want to leave any loose ends here. She's saying that. She's like, I don't, I don't want to feel indebted to you, right? It's so much more. It's so much more than that, Arya, and you know it. If I left now, I feel like I owe you. The prison is open, okay? Okay? There's, like she said, though, there's a lot more to it than that. The map boss monster will now appear. Is it an invisible? Where the... Huh? Wait, what? Wait, even Mc... Uh, guys, guys, what's going on? Um, I'm a little scared. <laughs> this is a little, f wait, okay, I wasn't that scared until McBurn, the game host, was like, wait, what? <laughs> then, then, now I'm terrified. At first, I thought maybe it was an invisible Shinwei. Am I mi- What the- Okay, wait, hold on a sec. I don't know if I'm ready for this. Wait, 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 wait a minute. I don't know about this. Okay. Maybe it's nothing much. Maybe the- Maybe it's a small monster and it escaped? 
Why is it empty? The boss isn't here. What's going on here? Yeah, McBurn is like, the frick? Wait, what? I, wait a minute, let's think about this. Let's think about this. For, hold on a sec. Okay. Yasracha was in Yama's path. Wait. Is it just is it just an ordinary monster? The boss monster is gone. Did someone teleport ahead? Or is this the work of Hockney's team? No way, that'd be way too busted. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Inside the cat tower. The prison where the boss monster from Bomb's field is kept! Wait a minute, it's the squids! It's the squids! Oh no. Wait a minute, wait a minute, it's the squids. It's Moshini's squids. We finally get to see Moshini's squids. I think it's one of the squids. I don't know what else to call them. I'm calling them the squids. He unlocked. He released the monster. The frick. This is definitely the key. Who are you? I think it's a she. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I better thank you for letting me use it. Mosh Moshini? <sighs> Time to go. The f got. Wait, so this this squid really I was wondering when the squids were gonna come into play. You got a goofy freaking thing. What the Yeah, don't fall! Whew. This sure is a dangerous place. I better get out of here. I've done my part. This is insane. This is really cool, actually. Dude, the Lopovia family does not hold back. Wait, but why? Why would they why would they do that? Why would they do that? Hey, it's this guy! Yeah, sorry about Arya, bro. You guys aren't merging anytime soon. Bro. Another wife. <laughs> I don't know. Mick Cage, sorry, not Mick Burn. <laughs> I'm playing I'm playing too much Trails of Cold Steel. Mick Cage, not Mick Burn. All right. I lost contact with Arya. There's definitely been a change in her spell since she went out onto the field. I need to get out of there soon. This guy's so cool. A mouse. Oh. Oh no 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 no. I'm scared that him and Coon are gonna run into each other. That's no no no. That one will be easy to catch. He's going in. Come on, Coon. Come on, Coon. Uh. Wait, what? Duh. What is happening? Is he about to run into someone? Whoa, 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 whoa. This guy's got... This guy's design is sick! Look at his eye! Yo, I love... This character design is so cool! Like, I was taken aback by the blue eye. Matt Boss really... What the frick? What am I looking at? Matt Boss released from prison hybrider! Hybrider? Hybrider? This was what Bomb was supposed to fight? Holy frick! This thing's insane! Jeez! That's really cool! Look at the mouse! The mouse is like, huh? <laughs> Dude, the freaking mouse. Hybrider! How strong- wait, if this thing's about to fight him, how strong is it? Whoa. Wait, this is the- this is the squid! I opened the prison for you. I've done my part. I'm retiring from the game now. Here we go! Where the heck did the 5th Army Corps commander find a monster like that anyway? Alright. Good job. Moshini! Dude, we get to see more Moshini? Bye. I feel bad saying this when everyone's out there fighting so hard. But having that boy here is way more entertaining. Wait, what? Huh? Wait, what? Having the boy here, like Bomb in the field? With what? Is she dooming Bomb? Wait, I'm confused. How is Bomb gonna advance without the boss? Is that what she's planning? 
She's planning for Bomb to just stay? Yes, he looks like kind of like Gojo. True. True, true, true. I wonder if dude can add people into his spell or limit it. I'd poke a ball this far. Yo, could you imagine? He's like, all right, Arya's gone. Boop, you're a part of me now. That'd be insane. Hybrider. That dude, SIU, his creature designs are always amazing. Like, sometimes they're more animalistic. Sometimes they're like abominations like this. So cool, dude. SIU never misses with his creatures. What are you up to? Who in the world is this? Oh, it's Jin Song! I'm so stupid! <laughs> so, who in the world is this guy? How arrogant I am Talk, talking about Papa Jin! We're getting more Papa Jin? Dude, we're getting more Jin Song Ha! What? Wait, 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 wait a minute. This is huge. This is huge. She wants Bomb to advance. Oh, intri- Oh, wait a minute. So she, so can they advance without the monster there? Yeah, she, she wants Bomb to get there. Oh, uh, wait, really? She means it'd be more fun if he mi- Oh! Okay, sorry, I totally misread that. Okay, okay, okay. So she's saying, nah, just make his way here. She wants she wants him to be with the master and oh shoot. Oh Mashani back at it again, bro. She's so smart, I couldn't even I couldn't even fathom it. She's so five head, five D chest that I couldn't even I couldn't freaking get through it, dude. Even, even, but Jin Sung is smarter than I am. Jin Sung Jin Sung knows. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. This is good! But I don't know if Bomb is gonna is, is gonna move on. That's the only problem. Bomb, remember your goal. Your goal is to rescue Jin Song. You can worry about White later. Gosh. What are you up to? So you didn't take me hostage and make Bomb join forces with Thug and attack here. So you didn't take me hostage and make Bomb join forces with Thug and attack here. So that's so that Jihad. Oh, you didn't. So that Jihad's forces could beat an innocent regular. To seem, you want to make it seem like you teamed up with Fug to punish a dangerous boy who tried to rescue his master, a rebel against Jihad's army? I can't understand why Jihad is going to all that trouble for something so simple. Why don't you just kill him? People have always been good at that. You want to make it seem like you teamed up with Fug to punish a dangerous boy? Am I missing something? This, this, the way it's worded make, is confusing me a bit. He's saying this isn't why you did it. You want to make it seem like you teamed up with Fug to punish a dangerous boy who tried to rescue his master, a rebel. So they're trying to like make confirm that bombs are like they're trying to make bomb go through it and then and then accuse him. Is that what's going on? Imagine with those coon jeans. True, true, true. Line translation, I figured. I, dude, at this point, I, I expect it more than I don't. So, what is it, so what's it supposed to mean, right? Um, someone can maybe clear that up if you already know. All right, let's keep going. I can't understand. Yep, we already read that. Jihad's army. Dude, look at Mod. Look at Mashi with the blue glow. The ten great families, and probably you too. If you all wanted the same thing, you probably wouldn't have bothered with this nuisance. You must have gotten your you must have gotten yourselves into this mess because you couldn't agree on what you wanted. Am I right? Interesting. If you all wanted, okay, so they're all in it for something different. Well, we knew Mashini. Like Mashini's kind of her own faction, right? Sure are clever. Is it the wisdom of old age? I mean, Jin Sung is pretty freaking old. Yeah, Mashini's pretty sick. You're right. Look at that panel, bro. Look at Mashini. 
Everyone has their own ulterior motives. That's why something as simple as killing one little regular became such a complicated mess. Makes sense. I can totally see that. So what do you think I'm up to? Dude, this is... Dude, Mashani's plan has been one of the biggest mysteries. There's so many theories. She's just in it for the bloodshed. She's in it for Jihad. She's in it for herself. She's in it for the, the 13th month. There's so much. I can't tell you that right now, but I can say one thing for sure. I don't want this story to have a boring ending. Hey, I'm fine with that, Mashani. I feel like Mashani's talking to the audience here. I want to keep it going until it gets a bit more interesting. I'm in love with this stuff. I love Tower of God. Can, I just, can, I, can we just get that straight? That's why I raised the stakes. But the game suddenly got so much bigger. Now there are people involved who not even I could stop if I wanted to. She looks so good. That's why I've kept you alive this long. Because you can keep that boy under control. And you were important to the Ha family. Understand? Okay, okay. Makes sense. Jin Song is a huge leverage piece for them. Especially for her. Yeah, the chat's going hard on my, uh, our... <laughs> that was probably bad wording. The chat is simping hard for Mashini. Yes. And I understand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Moving on. The real villain in this story isn't... Here yet. What? Real the wait, what? The real villain in this story isn't here yet. Huh? Wait, don't wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on! She can't mean like jihad. What if she's talking about the boss? No, the boss. I don't know if I'd classify the boss or the captain as a villain. What if it's the low Pobia family head? That would be too insane. There's no wait, she did say. There are people involved who not even I could stop. That's not that many people. Could you imagine? There's no way. Who is it? No freaking way. I don't know. So someone huge. Obviously, it can't be Jihad. Who the frick? What the heck? Where's the boss? Isn't the monster supposed to come out when the door opens? Hey, cat, what's going on? What am I supposed to do now? Well, just wait a minute. <laughs> he clicks the mute button on Discord, switches channels. What's going on? <laughs> He's freaking out. <laughs> He's like, um, give me one moment, please. Goes into the employee room. Guys, I need help. Where's the map boss? I just checked. Is this Nanatona? And it looks like it disappeared from the prison in the cat tower, bro. Mashani. Don't leave it to Mashani to freaking ruin the whole thing. What? It disappeared? Yeah, I think someone let it out of the prison. <laughs> Dude, what? This is insane! Things just got crazy! Rachel? Enryu? Huh? No. It can't be Rachel. No. Hey, is there a problem? How long am I supposed to wait? Don't you know how precious time is in this game? It's just... The monster suddenly disappeared. What? What the frick is this? So you expect me to just wait here until you bring the monster back? Doesn't this count as the monster forfeiting the game? We win since the monster ran away, right? I would say yes. What the frick is this? What is this? Guys? Guys? What is this? Guys? Guys? What is this? What am I looking at here? What is this? Why did SIU leave a tuft here? Um, what's going on? Tail? Yes, if in fact it did run away, then I believe it's your win. Meow. It's a, I imagine Nick, Nick Cage is talking through the cat, but it's like a voice filter, so it's like, meow. <laughs> Arya's like, well, that works for me. <laughs> Don't get your hopes up, Arya. Something freaking crazy is going on. Hey, regular! This is our chance. Let's get out of here. The map boss is gone. This is the perfect chance to get away from White. Come on, Bomb. Bomb, I need you to listen. Bomb, listen. Listen, please. God. Oh, this is the perfect chance. Could you imagine Bomb is like, no. I would. Mm. Come on, Bomb. Bomb, Bomb, Bomb. I'm done. Bro, I'm done with Bomb. 
I understand why you're doing it, Bob. It fits your character, but mm. You literally had the perfect opportunity. It's like a message from fate telling you to run. Sorry. I'm not leaving until I beat White. Oh, dude, like, like, bomb. Is this really ne I shouldn't have expected. I shouldn't have expected less from Bomb. What? Don't be so stubborn. You'll die if you fight White. How is throwing away your own life going to help your dead companions? Arya, freaking, listen to Arya. I'm not the type to stick my nose in other people's business. But it wouldn't feel right to just leave you here when that when you broke that spell for me. She's so nice. I don't want her to die. Let's go. Yes, force him. Force him. Force him. Grab him and just bolt. Hit him in the head and run. What would change if I just run away? What? My very existence puts everyone in danger. It's my fault that my master was taken prisoner and that my companions died. Will running away not change now? Change any of that? Okay, bomb. I, I don't know if you know this, but change kind of happens in time. But I told you. I left them because I didn't think I could travel with them any longer. I kept being faced with problems that were too big for me. So I made a cowardly choice. Ultimately, they died because of me. It's not true, bro. It's not, it's not true. It's a lie that you can ignore someone's death. It breaks my heart to run to think about it. How could I just run away without avenging my fallen companions? I'm going to fight and beat White right here. Then I'm going to rescue. I'm going to go rescue my master. I'm not running away. That's the least respect that I can show to those who lost their lives. If I can't even do that, I don't think I could forgive myself. I get it, bro. I get it. But the problem is, those are two big goals. And you're kind of smushing them together. This is your only chance to rescue Jin Sung. You can fight White another day. That's not true! Listen to her, please, God. Risking your life to fight those who died is one way of showing them respect. But think of your own life that they cared so much about! Arya! Yes! Sh scream in his face, bro! Do you really think that throwing it away in a hopeless fight like this is a good way to show them respect? Here we go. Bomb's starting to break. He's starting to break. We're making progress! We're making progress, Arya! Let's go! My life isn't the only one that matters. What? Everyone tells me that I'm special. That's also why there are people who hate me. But a lot of people died trying to help and protect me. But it's not true. All lives are equally precious. Everyone tells me that I'm special, but that's not true. My heart feels like it's breaking in two when I see other people die and get hurt. I would rather die than have than have to keep feeling this pain. Oh my Bro, what? What? I don't think my soul could take it if I saw any more precious lives lost. How could I run away? My feet refuse to move. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to fight with every ounce of strength that I have. And I'm going to win. This is insane. This 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 arc. It's cutting so deep into these characters. I've never seen dude, we're diving so deep into Bomb's character. It's so good. Alright. As you like. I couldn't really understand how this boy felt. Oh, she never had someone like that. But something occurred to me. Uh, uh huh. I don't particularly like associating myself with anyone. But this boy might not be so bad. Dude, please. 
please. I need you guys to just team up for good. Like, you know how Cha became Bomb's like one of his numbers? Look at Bomb, bro. You know how Cha sort of became one of Bomb's like, you know, Master Bomb kind of deal? You know, not, not Master Bomb, but you could be his ally. I don't know. I wouldn't mind having someone to mourn me like that if I know Arya. Okay, Arya, that's like the sweetest thing I've ever heard in this freaking story. But don't say that. She's never, she's never, dude, this tower's so fricked up. Most people don't have someone like that, that they can truly become close to and someone to mourn you when you die. Oh God, dude. Look at the way she's look. I can't handle this right now. Look at the way she's looking. She's like, it's kind of, Bomb gives off that vibe. Like when Kuhn first met Bomb, it was the same thing. Either go ahead to the finish line or hide somewhere. As long as you don't help me, White won't have a reason to attack you. If the tower chose one person with the power to break all the rules, this was the right person? I'm glad it was this boy. Oh, I, dude, this, I, this is too sweet. It all, It's almost too so sweet that I'm freaking scared. I'm scared because it feels like bad something bad's gonna happen death flags that's exactly what i'm saying great job voicing for bob thank you thank you thank you bro i'm freaking terrified white because he truly cares about people which is something that this tower doesn't have because people are kind of doofuses he would probably cry for me if i died it makes me happy but also kind of sad. Bro, they met like 15 minutes ago and they're already this tight. Let's go, dude. It's a strange mix of emotions. What can it be? Zing? What could it be? Um, I don't know. Affection? Love? It doesn't have to be romantic love. A bond? It could be romantic. E Evan Kel! Yo, we're going to Evan Kel's field! We have not seen Evan Kell since the hiatus, like barely. We saw her when we were deciding the teams. Kalavon and Evan Kell, we're actually getting Evan Kell's. Wait a minute, we did see Evan Kell briefly when Hansung arrived. I actually forgot about that. But, do, do, Hansung and Evan Kell? Look at this duo, let's go. We're finally in the same place together. Now hurry up and tell me, Evan Kell. Ah, uh, Hansung. Well, phew. What's going on? Evan Kell was gonna tell him the plan. What happened? Who is it? Who is it? <gasps> is it gonna be Mr. 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 Body Guy? Okay. Lafa. Lafa. Long time no see. Lafav. Wait, what? Wait a minute. LaFave was in the game? Wait, LaFave Wait, LaFave was participating? Wait a minute. What's going on? Wait a minute. What? <laughs> wait, I dude, I feel like SIU was like, "Wait a minute. I'm going to stay." <laughs> Cuz I swear she wasn't there, right? Like LaFave was freaking fighting for them? Interesting. Interest. I. Okay. Hey, well, welcome back to the story, Lafav. Okay, what's up? Yo, she looks really cool. Lafav? Huh? There's someone else on the field? You caught a mouse! And, dude, Lafav is on their side. Like, I, I knew she gave Evan Kell advice, but she's, like, legitimately is, like, on their side now. Okay. Lafav! Looking good. Well, I'm a good sniper, so I just found a place to hide and wait until a mouse passed by, and I shot it. She's like a hunter, that's so cool. Every sharpshooter needs a bit of luck. This poor mouse. I feel like an idiot for not thinking of that myself. Dude, look at the squad! What the frick? Anyway, it's good that you're here. I take it you must know too. So I'd like to ask you both something. I'll just come right out and ask. Where are you two going? Yeah, tell, please tell Hansung. Like, come on, you trust, tell him, tell him, tell him, just tell Hansung. 
This not, yeah, just because she's blonde doesn't mean she looks like Rachel. This is not Rachel, bro. Does this song look like Rachel? Uh, is it okay to tell him? Why are you guys sweat? It's Han Sung. You trust? Come on! I'm screaming so loud, my freaking soundproof material is breaking off. There's no point trying to hide it now that we're on the field. Somewhere in the nest, there's a portal connected to a very dangerous place. A very dangerous place? Stop beating around the bush and just tell me! Please, come on! I don't think you want to know. You won't want to fight if you find out. What's going on? Guys, what? You won't want to fight? It... Won't want to fight? I came here prepared for anything! I can take it! In that case, I'll just tell you. Dude, LaFave is freaking gorgeous! Like, I'll say it. I Someone's gotta say it, bro. Lafav looks freaking awesome! Unlike Jihad's forces gathered here, the branch leaders and I came to this nest through that, through that portal. Not a floating carrier. Okay. Although it was on a special floating ship, so I'm not exactly sure where the portal is. Everyone thinks that this nest is completely cut off from the outside world, but there's actually a single portal that leads to the outside here. And the portal that we came through. is connected to Lopobia's battleship! Okay, um... We may have a problem. Um... We may very well have an issue. Because if we believe that we had a chance of... Look at this ship. Look at this freaking ship. Look at this freaking ship. Are you guys seeing this? Dark Innovator, thank you so much. Remember what was said in earlier chapters? The nest is, itself is a trap. And now you begin to comprehend how bad it sets the realization. True, actually true. The fact that the ever you know, the, they're able to just surround the nest. They, they, they lure you in and then they can surround you. Holy frick. This isn't insa- This isn't- This- So what's the plot? We're dead. We lose. GG- GG- Friggin' GG Jihad. GG Lopobia. Huh? This nest has been connected to the battleship since long ago. I came here from the Lopobia family's battleship. No wonder there's Lopobias left and right flying out. Hansung is- His mind just died. And all the key figures of the Lopobia family's army are currently on that ship, including the family head. There's no way the family head is here. That means that Lopobia's army could attack here whenever they want. Dude, we lost. Hey, good game. We had a good run. It was a good try. This game's over. So Lopobia's top fighters could show up here at any moment? You mean, that's right. They wouldn't bother with small fries like us, of course. But the leader of Lopobia's army and their strongest warrior? <sighs> no. 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 There's no way. The leader of the Lopobia family could come through the portal too. There's no way. And if he does roll... It was a good run. Hey, GG Lopobia family. Good game. What? Bro. This isn't happening. It's over. It's GG no re. Hey, hey, we had a good um, we're super sorry about the war. Hey, we're super sorry about the war. Now, please don't leave us alone. For the love of God, please leave us alone. If the leader, the leader, it, that's what Ma, that's what Mashini was saying. 
Mashini was saying, I, there's certain people here that we cannot fight. I, I cannot influence, I have to find ways to influence them through Jinsung, through Bomb, because she can't actually do anything about them. Oh, it's over. Hey, we gave a, it was a good, it really was a good run though. Like it really was a good try. Oh my, dude, I, bro. Oh my, dude, all right. Uh, Dar Imperial Scout, thank you for this super chat. Good run, boys, good run. Absolutely. Jeremy Joestar, $2 super chat. I hope they have Yurik and Speeda. Bro, if we can just call in Yurik, call in Luzlak, call in freaking, I don't know, maybe a le some leaders of the 10 families, that might help a little bit, you think? Uh, hey, 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 Gustang, Gustang, I know we're not on the best of terms, uh, you know, you're working with, uh, snake girl Rachel, but could you, um, do us a favor, you know, you helped us out before, uh, we'll, get, we'll, we'll make it up to you later, okay, bye. I don't know, we need something, we need something. We need freaking any, the real villain of this arc is the leader of the Lopo Bia family. Dude, there's no way, we gotta get out, we gotta get out now, forget about the, forget about the cat tower. Forget about Gacha Dosang. Forget Jin Sung. I don't know about forget Jin Sung, but like we gotta get. You know what? Yeah, our lives are on the line right now. Oh my! This chapter was long. It was fun. It had incredible character development, bro. The character development, Mashini's schemes, freaking the monster and Arya and Bomb. And Evan Cal and Han Sung and LaFave coming in looking fresh. LaFave was like, you didn't forget about me, did ya? And she's like, I'm the waifu of this story, not Arya. Like, sheesh. It's insane. I, dude, what in the world? I can't. Look at this panel. Look at this. How many sh- That's a skyscraper. There's like- 200 skyscrapers on an island. Probably more than that. Where's Pericule when you need him? Bro, Brack, call Pericule. I know you guys still text. I know Pericule's the kind of guy that would text you like 30 times a day and even though you don't text back. Freaking respond and call him up. We need we need every man, every man on deck. What a great chapter. Deserving of every single like. Oh my god. Uh, can can next Sunday be tomorrow, please? Can I ha can Arya just spend all my time of the next week and then I can get to the next Sunday, please? Holy frick, bro. Dude. Dude. This was one of the best chapters. Like, this was an insane chapter. Insane revelations. It was so good. It was so good. Um, if you guys enjoyed my reaction, uh, don't forget to leave a like. Um, but more importantly, he's leaving a like for SIU. Because, you know, SIU... I don't know if SIU reads these likes, but like, I don't care if he does. You, the team does. We gotta support the team. We gotta support SIU, bro. We gotta make Tower of God the number one comic on Webtoon. Come on, it deserves it. It deserves it. It freaking deserves it. And then once you've done that, then you can like this video if you want. Then you can like this video. Bro, holy frick. This was so good. This was so good. This was, oh, okay. Aria for me, Aria. My respect for Arya has risen like tenfold. Because before I was like, Arya's cool, but she's just in it to, to break the spell. But now that Bomb broke the spell, Beauty and the Beast style, she's like, you know what? I actually want to stay. And it's like, what? And you and it's like, it wasn't done hastily. We got to see this whole freaking complex character arc. Dude. Do you think Lopup is a woman? Is that why she was made that, she made that dad, Baylor daddy loved someone else? I mean, that's an interesting theory, but we've seen a picture of the head of the Lofovia family. He looked a little bit shadowed, unless that was just to throw us off. But hey, maybe the leader of the Lofovia family is in, into guys, I don't know. Or maybe he liked uh, daddy Baylord's wife. I don't know. But that's an interesting thought. Bruno Neptune with the $5 super chat. Joe, you should play Dead by Daylight for Halloween special. Just an idea. This chapter was insane. That's a fun idea. Doing a Halloween stream. I'll definitely think about that. Thank you. And then Echo with the $4.99 super chat. Does that mean there are other Lopo Bias as strong as the evil cat boy? 
If so, that's terrifying enough. Who needs the family at that point? No, that's true. They literally said, like, the strongest warriors. Like Dakoko. Like Dakoko, we might not think of as strong. He was very, very strong. The leader of the bird branch or the wind bird branch. Imagine the other 19 branch leaders show up. We're freaking screwed at that point. We're freaking screwed. This was so good. <laughs> Hi, Joe. Hey, what's up, Dad? How's it going? Why? What's going on, Dad? Oh, man. This was good. This was good. This was a great chapter. This was a great chapter. All right. Um, I'm going to end by once again saying <clears throat> this Friday, Tower of God Pokemon stream. Boom. Be there. Be there or, or you're missing out. Let's put it that way. Be there or you're missing out. It's going to be really, really freaking fun. This Friday, 4 p.m. Eastern Time. More Tower of God videos coming this week, as always. Yes, that is my that is my dad. He's in the chat. What's up? What's up, Dad? How's it going? <laughs> Watching the Tower of God content. Let's go. We've recruited another one. Let's go. Um, 20 Yasrachas? That'd be insane. That'd be insane. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. The chapter was so, so good. Support SIU. Support the channel. Um, uh, stay tuned for this Friday. It's going to be fun. And with that, I'll see you guys next Sunday. Same time. 8.45 p.m. Eastern Time. And it's going to be a blast. Take care, everybody. See you then. <laughs> Tower of God, baby. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. <laughs>